Why are you needing mission, not just goals? My name is Mr. 1950. And like I always try to tell people, I appreciate your support. I appreciate you clicking on the video. Um, we got a deal. The deal is I do the videos for you. You click the like button for me. Thank you for coming by. Really quick. Why you need a mission and not just goals. I thought this was appropriate to talk about because I've noticed this a lot in the community and, and a lot of men that I talk to on a regular basis. They always talk about their goals in life, but they never really talk about their mission. And so we're going to we're gonna talk about five reasons, five reasons on why you need a mission and not just goals. And I think, I think you're going to get a lot of benefit from this video because I think it's important for you to stay focused, right? Stay focused on your goals, but also it needs to align with your mission. First and foremost, number one, let's start here. This is the number one thing to me. Goals are temporary missions are lifelong. I'm going to say that again. Goals are temporary. Missions are lifelong. I think that's very powerful, right? You know, goals can be checked off. You know, you, you can get 50 goals. Boom, 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 boom. You can do that. You can check goals off. You can check goals, and it's going to continue. You can check goals off, and you align them all in there, all right? But missions gives continuous purpose and direction. I'm going to say that again. Missions gives you continuous purpose and direction. That's powerful stuff, right? Like, this is continuous with the mission. There's goals that set up missions. You have to check your goals off to get to the mission, but the mission doesn't stop. The mission never stops. It's continuous, and it keeps you in your direction. It keeps you on your purpose. Nobody talks about this. Nobody, they always talk about your purpose. Nobody talks about this. I really want to know, and this is, I know this is after the first one, but I really want you guys to comment below on why you need a mission, not just goals. I think that I want to hear from you. I read all my comments. I want to hear from you. Number two, a mission shapes your identity, who you are. As a person, your mission shapes your identity. If you had a mission of destruction, it would show us who you are as a person. So if your mission shapes you and your identi identity, you got to remember, it defines who you are and what you stand for. It defines who you are and what you stand for. And if you don't, if you don't understand that, man, I want you to really look at your life and say, you know what? What am I doing? Why is why is it why is it why is not my goals and my mission aligned with who I am as a man? Wait, why? I, I need y'all to understand this is all to help you men develop as men. All right. You know, guiding your actions based on your decisions. Guiding your actions based on your decisions that 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 definitely comes from your mission and your goals. All that aligns. All of all of it aligns and it should align. Let's be real. I mean, all of it should align. All right. The next one. Missions inspire Discipline. <laughs> I'm going to say this again. 
because I get a lot of discipline questions. Missions inspire discipline. This is kind of self-explanatory, but I'm going to go into it a little bit. The mission that you have, the purpose that you have, you, in order to complete any of those, you must complete goals. And having goals, you must be di- disciplined to, to complete them. This is actually really simple. But it's hard because a lot of you men don't stick to being disciplined. I, I'm, I'm, I'm one of those. Right? I'll work out two weeks straight. And then take a week off, right? So I, I found that I, I need to do something every day, right? So I said, you know what? Let me just do something every day of some type of workout. So I hit the heavy bag. You know, I'll do things that will keep me on task, to keep me disciplined to my goal. Because the worst thing, the worst lie you can tell is to yourself. And I ain't going to lie to myself in regards of what I should be doing every day, right? So the mission's inspired discipline and that, and that is the truth number four goals changes so your goals they'll change your mission evolve <laughs> i'm gaming today your goals will change your mission evolve while some goals may shift you may shift a couple of little goals you know what a mission adapts without losing the core. Let me say that again. A mission adapts without losing the core of your purpose. Goals change, missions evolve. We we must we must do more. To meet our goals, yes. But we're spending our lives completing our mission, which is our purpose. Goals change, missions evolve. I think that's very powerful. And last one, number five. I believe when you have a strong mission, you attract the right people and the right opportunities. You know, when you have a clear mission, like you have a clear mission written down, the opportunities align with your values and vision, you meet all the appropriate people in order to go in the direction you need. Being that organized. Making sure everything is aligned to your purpose. You know, that attracts the right people to come around and say, you know what, I can help you with this. Or I can do this for you. Or you know what, I've been doing that. I've been suffering with some of these things. And now you guys can relate. And now you guys can talk about things to build the community. It is so important. So number five, look, you're going to attract the people that best align with your mission when you're organized and I'm telling you, you will get the opportunities you want and need. I want to say this before I get up out of here. Last thing I make these videos for you. You click the like button for me. My name is Mr. 1950. If this is your first time here, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification button. Don't miss out on my lady on my latest videos. And then also I'm the last traditional man on the planet Mr1950.com, get at me. Peace. Silver Bear!